Nobody does Star Wars like the power of the Force from Kenner. What is going on, Star Wars fans, and welcome to another episode of Power of the Force Friday. Got a few, one of my favorites, Anakin Skywalker. Pre Hayden Christensen. And uh, yeah, this is this is one of my favorites, honestly. Like favorite figures in my collection. You know, I have a lot of sentimental value with my um, you know, original Power of the Force. You know, last 17 vintage Anakin Skywalker, um, which is more so the spirit of Anakin. But this one is almost like an imagining, imagining what Anakin would have looked like, or would look like, had he kept going, had his life been a little bit more normal. Um, yeah, obviously based on the likeness of Sebastian Shaw, who was the one who portrayed. Anakin Skywalker in Return of the Jedi as both his force, original Force spirit and um, taking off the mask at the end on the Death Star. But yeah, when this figure came out when I was a kid, you know, this was this was brilliant. And I think, um, pretty sure, sort of, this was 99, I think. Let's have a look here. Yeah, 1999. So, the time of this one's release, um, you know, Jake Lloyd had well and truly been cast as Anakin, you know, it was probably a few years off, of, a couple of years off of Hayden Christensen being cast. Um, I wondered whether they ever had any plans to sort of get to this likeness at some point, or whether that sort of changed during development. Very, very interesting. I used to have lots of crazy imaginations about what happened uh, with Anakin and Obi-Wan, or Ben Kenobi, back in the, uh, before the prequels, you know, it was before they were established, before those stories were established, and, and how it all, how it all fell apart. I, I, you know, my, my memory is a little bit behind there, I can't really remember any of what I imagined, just because we've had so many stories and content since. Uh, that has really sort of fleshed that out, but um, you know, I always thought the Force Spirit of Hayden Christensen was a welcome addition uh, when they decided to, you know, phase it out and switch it out. But uh, I would have preferred if they'd, they'd maybe tried. They could even do it now, and that is really try and uh, blend the two together. So, so you get a little of a mix of Hayden, even age him up. You know, age him up, give him short hair, and maybe do a little bit of a. A little bit of a face mash together with uh, with Sebastian Shaw. I, I, I just don't think that would be an issue there at all. I think most people would probably come to the party with that. Um, I don't think that there'd be too many disappointed people if they were to if they were to give that a shot. I'd be all for it. Um, so he does come with his lightsaber. This isn't the one he comes with. I have literally give, just given him the uh, the original Anakin Skywalker lightsaber, but this one just sort of came with a you know pretty generic looking saber, which someone else currently has. I'm not sure. It might just be in the accessory box. I just wanted to give him the uh, the actual Anakin Skywalker lightsaber. But I dig the uh, the longer robes. Like we saw on uh, Ben Kenobi in A New Hope. I like that sort of... I don't know, it feels a little bit more ceremonial. A little bit more... You know, Peacekeeper. You know, we know that sort of... The shorter robes were, were made for the prequels. Just because they were going to be in more action, so... You know, I like that sort of... Little shorter bits there. They could switch in and out. It would have been cool to sort of see those longer robes on the Jedi in the prequel, sort of out of battle mode, sort of whether it be, you know, Jedi Council meetings or something like that. I think that would have been really, really cool just for a little bit of extra continuity. Not that that's a big deal at all anyway. But yeah, so this is a really nice look. I, I really do like this look of Anakin Skywalker. I'd love a, <laughs> I'd love an up-to-date 
sort of super articulated version of Anakin like this. I think that'd look really, really nice. But uh, you know, for now, this one this one looks good. Oh yeah, uh, yeah, really, really like that this, this one. And it's cool to have his uh Force Ghost as well, which I did do a video of a couple months back now. So you can just go through my uh, Power of the Force Friday playlist and you can check out the uh, Force Spirits, Jedi Spirits video I did, which is uh, Anakin, Obi-Wan and Yoda. So yeah, I'd love to hear your thoughts on Anakin Skywalker. Yeah, what did you think of the change when they uh, changed the spirit to... Hayden Christensen. I'm okay with it, but I definitely feel like they could have met somewhere in the middle. I think that would have worked quite well. Um, you know, even doing it today, just splitting it down the middle and giving us a little bit of both, I think that would be fine. Just like the uh, look of his face here, you know. He's Anakin was a good friend. You sort of get that feeling. Awesome. Alright guys, well thank you very much for watching. Appreciate you all tuning in for another episode of Power of the Force Friday. We'll be back very, very soon with some more videos. Stay tuned. Until then, please like the video, subscribe if you haven't, and hit the little notification bell so you don't miss any future videos that come out. And uh, yeah, until then, I'll see you then. May the force be with you, always.